hello welcome back so in this video we are going to see some rounding of operations so we know earlier how to declare a variable and assign a value to it so I declare a variable a and assign a value 5.8 to it now we may need to round that to nearest integer so there, are, there is a command or function called round a so it will round it to nearest integer so if a is equal to 5.2 and if I call the round function so in this case it went to nearest integer of 5.886 here nearest integer of 5.2 is 5 same is true with negative value so it is a is minus 5.2 and if I call round so it still goes to nearest integer that is minus 5 and one more obvious question what if a is equal to 5.5 so it goes to next integer there is another function called fix so what it does is it moves the it moves the value towards zero on the uh, number axis so here uh, a was uh, 5.5 so it moved the value towards the zero so suppose if a is equal to 6.9 and if i call the fix a it will go to zero so uh, well, first integer while moving towards zero is six so it comes as a six now if a is equal to minus 6.9 okay then the first integer that comes while we move towards zero is minus six so the value of fix a will be minus six so that's how fix moves the value towards uh, zero and uh, whatever first integer comes that will be the value of the function next there is another function called as CEIL okay so this moves the value towards positive infinity so if a is equal to 5.8 again and if I call the function so the value will be 6 now suppose if a is equal to 5.1 still the value of cell a will be 6 because it moves towards positive infinity and then whatever first integer comes it will be the function will return that value so when we are at 5.8 the nearest integer is actually 6 still uh, but when we move towards positive integer uh, positive infinity the first integer that we come across is 6 and that's why the answer is 6 even in uh, this case when the 5.1 a is 5.1 the first integer that come across when we move towards positive infinity is 6 and the answer is 6 suppose if a is equal to minus 2.3 the value will be minus 2 because on the number axis when we are at minus 2.3 and then we decide to move towards positive infinity the first integer that we come across is minus 2 and that's why it is minus 2 and same way there is another function called as floor that uh, gives us the value towards negative infinity so if I call floor a and it now moved towards negative infinity and the first integer that uh, come across while moving towards negative infinity is 5 so the answer is 5 if a is equal to uh, 5.1 and say a, uh, sorry floor a so still the answer is <coughs> same 5.8 and if a is equal to minus 9.1 and now when we move towards negative infinity the first uh, uh, integer that comes is 10 when we move towards negative side 
and the answer is minus 10 in this case so that's all uh, for this video see you soon